sent this flyer and said he wanted us to redesign it during our um, design challenge so we're gonna give it a try all right so this is the design okay so this is the size all right but i'm gonna adjust the size here to this instagram post size all right so don't mind the plenty things you see here that makes it look like it is so complicated it's not really complicated so i'm going to get something that we'll, we'll use as a background all right so let's, let's use this guy all right um let's uh all right let's try this guy up send to the back okay all right so i'm going to bring in something very important all right so i'm going to click here increase brightness all right work on this saturation i work on the year mm. all right so i'm going to bring in uh, this guy here um, we're at that, we're at that, we're at that, we're at that, we're at that. bringing this guy here. So there are several buildings I saw that we could use, alright, but I thought this one was really, really very close to original. So, I decided to give it a try. So I'm going to take out that um, flag at the top there. This plan right here. We're going to change the color to purple. All right, so we'll bring it there. We'll send it to the back. We'll send this image to the front. All right, so we get our colonial logo. So we get the colonial logo, convert it to white. All right, and fix it. On, on it like this then um this this guy here we're going to uh, work on it a little so i'm going to click here i would increase reduce this and i will reduce this in a little all right then i'm going to bring in this guy here okay I'll just stretch it out like this um, and reduce opacity. Right. Okay. So um, this flag, this flag, I'm going to move it here. What did I do just now? Take it to the back. Take this to the back. So we'll just copy the flag. Right, then switch it like this. Right. Then copy this guy here. And bring this here. Right. Then um, we have this guy. So I'm gonna bring in this guy here. Um, Let's bring in this guy. Uh, it's too much. Let's open this a little. Let me just open it a little. Bit. No, it's a bit too much. Let me see the other one. Let me see this one. Uh, go to your color. Don't like this one, activate it. Alright, so I'm going to bring in this image right here. I'm going to position it here like this. Um, Alright. Okay. I'm going to copy this one, I just adjust it like this. Let's see how I can fix some of them here. Um, Okay. 
So this is length um, flare. This one had this to the design. I'm just gonna increase it like this. Right, so put one there. Bring this to the front, this to the front, and this to the front, and this to the front, and this to the front. Then I'm going to uh, this guy. I'm going to go to the erase color and then enable it and take out these rough edges. And I'm going to copy that same long guy. This one here, I'll copy it. I'll fix it here. I will increase the brightness and the contrast. No, the brightness a lot. Right. Okay, that means we're going to now send this to the back. Then send the the building to the back. Then send this one to the back. So, so we have something like this, right? Alright, so that same guy. You just use this one, copy it. We'll bring it here. Right, bring this here. This sorry. Towards this edge here. Alright, then we'll copy it again and fix it towards this part here. We're just gonna use black to fix it there. Alright, then um we're going to learn most of the part of the design, which is this guy here. So we're going to save this design. So just save it. Colonial flyer three. Alright, so I've saved it. Then I'm going to bring in this guy. Okay, so what I'm going to do with it is just take this out. Uh -huh. Then uh Okay, so let's let's fix it here. Alright, so let's fix it here like this. Alright. So the one I'm going to fix it is this. Okay, let me just leave it. Let me just leave it first. Let's just save the design again. Alright, so this is it, right? Okay. So we have something we're going to do right now. So right here, we're going to type in okay, apostle. Alright, so we're going to use um script fonts. Um Alright, so let me just use this. So the next one is just just for sell now. Alright, for social sure, sell man. Alright, so we'll, we'll just drag it here like this. Yeah, try and close out this space. Alright, so just try and centralize it like this. Centralize this one too. <coughs> then bring in the shape. So this this shape here, I'm just gonna drag it like this. Then reduce this go here, change the color to white. Let's increase this line. We'll just go here, right? East, right? We'll fix it inside the box. Right, so. Okay, so the next one is the word life. <laughs> so, so I'd like to add this. Then come over here, look for leaders. All right. Then you stretch it out like this. Make sure you stretch it out very well like this. Okay. So that's all we got here. So go over here, click on this, transparent, then click on this, save it as a JPEG. Right, when you're done, go back and open this design. Alright, so when you open it, just import that guy that you just worked on. Alright, grab it. Alright, like this. Then reduce it. Just reduce it. Then bring this guy here. Then you're gonna do this. Add a shadow to it. Alright. Um, let the shadow look like it's gonna fall out like this. Then you're going to now do the magic. Go to perspective, enable it, click on this, then let's work on it now. So I'm going to fix it like this. Alright. I see that now. Then you fix it, see it, enter that. Sit properly inside that guy. Alright, so you can even zoom it if you if you want to see it very well. So I'm adjusting it. Alright, make sure that it's sitting inside the screen on the screen and it's sitting properly like it is real. Alright. Alright, so I think it's well done. Then I'm going to kind of stretch it. 
right? Okay, so uh, I think um, this one I have to go to the okay, so this one I have to go to the back, then the building have to go to the back again, then uh, this background have to go to the back. Of course, this guy have to go to the back now. Then uh, the building this guy goes to the back again. All right, so that's what we have here. This is what we have, right? <coughs> then you can just add some other um, design that will fill it, fill up on those spaces. So I'm bringing it to the front. All right, so I've copied it. I'll bring this guy here. So I'll just write it like this. The same perspective. Perspective, where are you? So I'll just enable it and I'll try to fix it inside the this guy. Okay. 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 Alright, so what I'm going to do there? Just reduce the opacity. Alright. We'll send it to the back. Then we'll send this guy to the back. That is the building to the back. We'll send this guy to the back. Okay. Then what else? We'll send this guy to the back. Then we'll send this guy to the back again. So this is what we have. Then we can bring that same picture. Let's copy it. Alright, so we can bring it here. Alright, so that is just it. So, um, yep, um, after we're done with this, um, I can copy this one here. <laughs> Reduce it. Reduce it again. Uh -huh. Put it there. Copy it again. Reduce it. Still rotate this time. Put it there. Alright, so I have something like this now. Alright. Then we'll bring this right out to the front. Alright, so where the magic happens is when you are done with your design and you go and you retouch it. Alright, so I'm going to save it right now. Okay, so the design is saving. I'll quickly go to Lightroom. I'm going to open the design quickly. Smoothing. Click here. Alright, you see the line. Same. Click on edit, click on detail. Increase this. Go to noise. Oh, and this one. Increase it. Then save the design. I don't to fix that. Import the design. All right, so just go over here where you have add photos. Then let's link the lens. Go to blend. Go to screen. Here we have it. So in the design, there is there are some places where this lens effect is very very prominent. At the back here. Can reduce it and we're gonna adjust it to so reduce it. Then you copy it. Right, then you bring it here. Try prominent it there. Then you can hold it again and duplicate. I'll bring it down here. Try prominent it here. But this one you're going to reduce it to the back the the right. So the, that's what we have at the end of it. So when you are done with everything you want to do, you can go ahead and save the design. This design I've saved. I'm going to go to Snapseed and do the final retouch. My name is Neil Amuda. Don't forget to like this video and share it with your friend. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials like this coming your way. So right here on Snapseed, I'm going to make the design pop. Oops. Um, there are other effects here like this one, all these one. So I just different pop now. And um, let me see the currents. Right, smooth. Alright, I think that's it. Yeah, so you can try all that effects. I just want to go to this. Alright, then I'll do it again. It's got it too much. Alright, so this is what I have at the end of the day. That's what I've got. Yeah, don't forget to like this video and share with your friend. My name is Neil, and I'll see you in another tutorial. Thank you for watching.